Kelly Marcy here. Hope you're having a fabulous day. So I'm doing a video today to tell you about my first time ever getting and having a colonic. So what is a colonic? It's basically a way of detoxing where they um, kind of spray or insert water into your colon and flush all of the poopy out. Like I told you, I love poop. I love talking about poop because everybody poops. So why not talk about it? Uh, but yes, the colonic, um, again, the water goes up into your colon and it cl cl cleanses your body of, you know, just junk, you know, poop that's been in there forever. They say that poop can be in your colon for years and just never cleaned out because it's impossible without doing something like this. In addition to potential parasites and mucus and like yeast, like lots of different types of things. So anyway... That was my uh, um, experiment of choice. So again, while I was nursing, breastfeeding, you can't do any of this type of stuff. It can be dangerous to your baby. When you're detoxing, it's just not recommended uh, because you can kind of excrete that type of stuff into your breast milk and it's just overall not safe. So now that I'm not pregnant or nursing, I wanted to give it a try. So let me tell you about my visit so i went to get the colonic i had to wait they only had one person at a time doing it she was a little bit late so that was already like eh that sucks so waited about 20 30 minutes just to get started and they put me for 10 minutes on this vibrator machine i think it's like those machines where people get up there to like lose weight where you kind of put your hand and your body just shakes you know you just shake so my body was shaking what that was doing was kind of waking up my digestive system waking up my the blood flow in my body and waking up my bowels so that i can be ready so i then proceeded to go back to the room pretty small room pictures here for the little contraption of what would be there and so there's a tv on the wall and there's the basically where I sit. So again, prior to me going, I had no idea what to expect, um, what it looked like or anything. Me and my husband had this running joke that he was just like, well, the only way you can possibly do it is if you stand up and bend over and they stick it up. That's not how they did it. So um, she gave me a uh, covering to cover myself. So I had to just take my clothes off from the waist down. You basically sit on this like tub and there's a tube and you put that tube into your anus basically butthole <laughs> and uh she gives you some lubricant and you basically ring the bell and she will come back in to start the process well marcy had issues getting that tube up into my anus it just wouldn't go it was actually kind of sharp because it's just plastic it was kind of sharp at the top so i had a lot of struggles doing that that wasted like another 15 minutes i had to come and she didn't really help and I've, I've heard of other experiences they will actually do it for you so for me yeah she didn't help quite a lot so that was a little bit frustrating just not being able to physically get it in and it feel like it's in so it's supposed to go in about an inch um so nothing too crazy so once i got it in at least i thought i did uh, she began to flush the water so there's a tank in front of me that i can see all the water and there's um, a clear tube that i can see in a mirror of what will come out and so again it kind of follows through and what i can say about the process is that it was actually very neat and clean i didn't have to worry about like poop like smelling poop or seeing poop oh, you you saw it in the tube but again it's in the tube and i'll explain that in a second but overall wasn't a big deal at all so that was very impressive <laughs> um so whenever she came in she started flushing the water so the water that she puts in you is warm water so that warm water goes into your colon in addition to that she gives you a big heating pad to go across your stomach because your stomach will cramp that was something else that i was not expecting so she began to flush the water so this process is supposed to last about 45 minutes to an hour i went about 45 to 50 minutes and for the first 15 20 minutes um nothing was happening i'm like what's going on this is stupid <laughs> so um she she she, she kind of stayed with me and then she left for about 15 those 15 minutes where i'm sitting there like what's going on and then she came back but she um, again she put pushes the water um, through uh, does it by itself but the water goes through it kind of fills up your colon and how she instructed me was you let the water fill your colon all the way up to the point where you feel like you gotta let it out you know like don't um, automatically push the poop out weight and so much pressure is going to build up into your colon to the point where you have to and when you do you push it out and when you push it out the poop's supposed to come out so again 
for me, because I couldn't get it in there right, wasted the first 15 minutes. It just, 15, 20 minutes really, <laughs> it just didn't work. And eventually I got the hang of it and the cramps were a little bit intense. Um, not enough for me not to do it again. I think I would still do it again. But um, again, uh, water, water went up uh, really, really warm um, into my body. It, felt, it feels like your stomach is just huge, like full of water. You push it out and then it's kind of back to your normal self. And yes, poop started coming out and it was pretty interesting. Um, not as much as I thought. So for me, I think I have a pretty healthy diet in terms of uh, pooping. I try to poop one to three times a day because pooping is very good for you and you should be cleaning and detoxing your body if you're drinking healthy uh, uh, drinking healthy drinks and eating healthy foods you should have a pretty regular system so that's what you want to have so anyway um, getting through that process it was really interesting I think the most frustrating thing about my experience I was really wanting her to tell me what did you see so after that I proceeded to wait in wait in the waiting room little area once you're done and I was just like well she's gonna come out and tell me what she saw she, she was just like oh you didn't really see anything so prior to that I happened to eat some black quinoa which looked like sesame seeds to her and she goes well I can tell those sesame seeds are working for you and that's something that I know eating the black quinoa it is a good cleanser like it will make you go to the restroom so she found that so she did find some mucus in uh, my poop and this is TMI but you're watching this video so you must want to learn what a colonic is and what might be the outcome so I did have mucus now for me because I know my body and I knew what I ate um, I was at the time drinking some protein that wasn't agreeing with me because I don't handle whey protein very well and I was trying something that had whey protein I haven't had whey in years and it was really bothering my stomach like it was really like eh, not doing too good and that can cause mucus meaning your body is rejecting it basically so I got that out and then she saw a little bit of um she said bile so that was quite interesting some bile came out and that's all she saw so I was really hoping parasites would come out and I can do another video on that if you're interested just leave it below and I can tell you all about my parasite cleanse I did it right at home and I can tell you the products that I used to do it and it really did work I was shocked to see parasites um, however if I'm getting cleaned I would have thought that more would have come out she said she didn't see them, so I guess she didn't see them. but overall I would do this uh, again was my experience great with this particular place not particularly so i was at clean start atlanta um in atlanta and for me customer service just wasn't all that the lady at the front desk she was very nice but the lady doing it she was already a little flustered she said that multiple people were having issues getting the tube into their bowl <laughs> and i guess she just wasn't having a good day and it just didn't make it for a good experience but i was glad to excrete whatever i excreted and why a lot of people go is to lose weight so again i can personally say i think i lost maybe one pound and i have kept that off which is pretty neat um afterward um you do i ate i, I had a plan that's when i first started eating soups and so i had a plan to eat healthy so i didn't want anything heavy i didn't want to like feel sick or you know like risk it um i can say when i went came home i did have to run to the bathroom <laughs> the first time because i was like oh buddy gotta go um but other than that um you're back to your normal life especially the that afternoon or the next day um you could definitely work um i still came home and worked if you if you need it to work and want to try it but again i'm all about experimenting i, I recommend you try it why not uh, if it's safe make sure of course you get it cleared by your doctor if you have any type of issues give it a try and that's my experience with a colonic let me know below if you've tried it and any other videos you want to hear about, learn about, or want me to go try. See you later. Bye.